Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Both Barrels. I'm Bern. This is my father Curtis, and today we have a special guest, Jamie, from the Three Whisketeers. Hello. And he brought us some coffee to try out. Can you tell us anything about this? I wanted to contribute to the show and hopefully get a spot in as a guest. So I was on Amazon and looking up whiskey type things, and I saw that they had uh, this, I don't know if it's whiskey infused or how they did it, or they keep the beans in the barrel for a while? It, it looks like barrel aging is involved somehow, because it's aging style uh, barrel aged beans, so somehow the beans must be aged. They um, in with the whiskey when they age it? Oh. <laughs> That'd be interesting. Yeah. Um, let's see, it's a medium roast. It has an interesting scent, particularly when you're just sniffing it from the bag. And to start out with, I think we should just try this straight, and then if we want, we can add cream and stuff later. It's very hot. Yeah, uh, it's not the normal coffee taste that I'm used to. Yeah. It's... You can, can taste sort of a bourbon flavor to it. I mean, the coffee sort of does overwhelm it, but there is a, a bourbon in the background. Must be what it is. Yeah. Because it doesn't have a normal coffee taste, so there is something... Well, I don't really drink coffee. I usually have tea. Straight. Um, I, I think I'd probably want to add some cream or something to it since it's a little bitter up front. Like maybe some bourbon cream? Maybe bourbon cream. I guess we could do that. I was just going to throw in whey protein, but, you know, that works too. I'm not really much of a coffee eh, coffee enthusiast. I typically just drink 8 o'clock. Um, a lot of times some coffees tend to be, like, a little too bitter for me. Um... And some of them, like, are a little bit more mildler, which I typically prefer. This is okay, but I think I'd want to throw some cream in it or something, because it seems very bitter and stringent up front. Well, it says that it is uh, roasted on 12-6-2018, hmm. uh, batch number 26, uh, package number 6, and approved by JK. Hmm. So it, it, it almost looks like sort of something you might see at the bottom of a whiskey bottle. Whiskey yeah. yeah, yeah, that's interesting. I hadn't noticed that. Worth a try? I guess it's worth a try. Um, I mean, I, I drink coffee, but I don't know much about it. I typically just like drinking weak, mild stuff that's not particularly interesting, and that's probably not what this is. So if you want something that's interesting and unique and kind of... Uh, bitter in a pleasing way, then this is probably something that's worth trying out. I'm probably just going to stick with 8 o'clock, to be honest. Right. <laughs> <laughs> well, I thought it'd be an interesting topic. It's, it's, yeah, it was definitely fun to try. To try. Yeah. yeah. All right. Anything else you guys want to add? No. 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 Not thank really. you, Jamie. Yeah, yeah thank you, Jamie. Yeah, anything. Well, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to like, be sure to subscribe, leave a comment if you have any further questions, share this video around if you enjoyed it, and as always, thank you for watching.